Right when I got back from Vancouver Island, I was a mess. That's what my wife said. She said I was a hot mess. I didn't want to reintegrate into society. I couldn't be in crowded places anymore. It made me really twitchy. I hated going to work again. Rachel, this one really made me realize how much I miss you and miss the family. I think I'm healed now. I think this healed me. <laughs> Oh, I didn't even think of that. I think this did heal me. I think this trip healed me. I was such a mess after Vancouver Island. I just didn't want life at all. I didn't want anything. Now I want it all. I want it back again. Since I've been here, I've realized I truly, deep down, need my family. It's not a superficial need. I need my family to survive. But I'm conflicted because I know I could stay longer. It would be torture staying longer. I want to go home. I miss my family. I miss the creature comforts in life. I'm done. Hello, this is Larry. I'm ready for you guys to come get me, man. Mongolia kind of slapped me upside the head and said, listen, you little moron. You got a good job. You got an awesome wife. You got fantastic kids. Just." Stop moping around and enjoy life. I've just enjoyed the experience so much more than I did on Vancouver Island. And now I'm ready to go home. And I've got fantastic people in my life that I want to keep close to, and I don't want to leave them ever again. And that's what I learned out here. I'm going to remember what it's like to starve. I'm going to remember what it's like to not be able to talk to your friends or talk to your wife. But I'm also going to remember the blue sky, the ice crystals on the trees. I'm going to remember my fishing pole and how I caught a lot of fish on that. I've gotten everything out of this experience I can get. I had the most pleasure, the most discomfort that helped teach myself these lessons. Vancouver Island broke me down to just a shell of a person. This time, I am leaving on my own terms. It's OK to know your limitations. And it's OK. I don't have to push myself as hard as I've pushed myself my entire life. I'm starting to realize that. <laughs>